Hi everybody, I hope you are doing great. I wanted to share with you my kind of idea of a flat mail. It's not so flat, but I'm not very good at doing flat. I'm gonna keep trying. Anyway, um, let me show you this. So first off, I have this little clipboard. This is 100% inspired by Tamika, who is Scrapped a World. She had a tutorial on making something like this, and it might have even been this size where you drill a hole through a piece of wood, you paint the edges, you decorate it up. I used the Dolce Collection by Prima, and I just added some glitter on here. I sewed around the edges. I covered the back. I painted gold around the edges. I have to put my stamp on there. And then you put a clip here to put some embellishments. So for my first embellishment, I made some die cut flowers that I cut out on my Cricut Joy and just put some cute centers on them. And then I made a wax seal for the topper. And then my second embellishment, I used the Prima Dolce Collection um, mold that they have. And I just did some different quick resin that you can use the amazing resin in different colors that I poured. And you can use these on any kind of project, cards, scrapbook pages, mixed media projects, all kinds of journals, all kinds of stuff. So I made one of those. Oh, the bow I got from Denise, who is Solo Crafts, and a swap we did from the Coffee Cake and Crafting Facebook group. And she did a whole bunch of colors for me and I loved them. And then my last one, I did an easy topper. My son's over here trying to uh, distract me. Um, this is a Brad, just with a piece of the paper from the collection going across the top. Some of the flowers that I got from the collection. And these are inspired by Anna, who is Ser Serenity Creations on YouTube. These are so fun. These could be just embellishments on, them own, on their own. They could be flower centers. They could be anything. And I love how those came out. And I'm going to be sharing a few videos on some embellishments that I want to send to people as racks and how I like to package them up. And then you just find how you like them to fit. Mine are a little bit big, but that's okay. So then you just find out how you want to clip them on here. Make it pretty as you like. And then you can send them out. Okay, and then I also made a couple of little um, file folders and I decorated them with a gold clasp and then I make these little garment pins and I just put a whole bunch of sequins on them. I love how those come out. They're super simple and super fun. Open it. I just decorated mine with a puffy sticker and some of the, um, I don't know what collection these words are from, but I put those on there and then I sewed all the way around and then you open it up and I will be sending the person some wreath die cuts. I love using wreath die cuts and lots of different kinds of embellishing. So in that one I put those colors and I thought they matched collection. And then, and I know who I'm sending this to and I know this person has the Prima collection. And then I did another one of these again, decorated here, sewed around again. And then some wreaths here again and some frames. So that is one way that you can send some embellishments. I will be wrapping this up along with something else small that um, I'm sending the person and I hope she will like it. Thanks you guys for watching. Take care, bye-bye.